Now, first alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner. Is it just me or was it just a drab, dreary looking kind of day? We've got a couple of rain showers remaining, not many, but we're seeing a little bit in northern Vermont, northern New York, Danamora, Lion Mountain, a couple of drops coming down over toward Beekman Town, Plattsburgh, up towards Swanton and also St. Albans. This stuff is going to leave. We catch a break for a while. First part of tomorrow for the most part is going to be dry. I mean, maybe the odd rain shower. Then it's going to rain by the afternoon. We've got a bunch of rain coming into the Great Lakes right now. A little bit concerned here. You know, tomorrow's free cone day. I will be serving it up on Church Street. Also, uh, we're going to be live there during the afternoon. If you can stop by, it's always it's such a party atmosphere. It's a real blast. So hope to see you there. All right, right now we're looking at a bunch of clouds. We are looking from Jericho where it is 43 degrees. We've got a southwest wind at just three and temperatures. If you notice the colors here, something's going on down this way. Hang on just a second. It's warmer in Saranac Lake than in the Champlain Valley. It is certainly warmer in Bennington than really anywhere else on the weather map, but you really want to see some warm stuff. Look at Scranton, PA, not that far from here, really 74, 67 in Pittsburgh, 74 degrees in Detroit. That stuff wants to get here, but I'm telling you it is going to struggle. We've got a front that is sitting there. We've got a flow coming in from the ocean. It's not helping us out. That's why it's been so cold and it's going to be pretty cold out there tonight. Temperatures dipping down into the 30s, mid 30s, thinking a low about 34 degrees roundabout there. First thing tomorrow morning, that right in the Champlain Valley. Now, clouds will be thin first thing tomorrow morning. Yes, mostly cloudy, maybe just a little bit of sunshine. Then the clouds thickening up as that system comes from the Great Lakes, and we've got some rain that will be here by the afternoon. So on our way there, this is Futurecast. The rain tonight leaves. Here's your first thing tomorrow morning. Again, maybe the sun trying to poke through. It's certainly going to be mostly cloudy. Three o'clock in the afternoon, that's rain in northern New York. It's coming down at a pretty good clip by five o'clock. It's coming through the Champlain Valley and into northwestern Vermont and really all of western Vermont. And that means it's going to be wet for your evening commute. Now watch what happens a little bit later on. That rain is going to mix with and change to snow showers. I think most of those are going to be in the higher elevations. But on Wednesday, maybe the odd snow shower first thing in the morning before that stuff does leave. So in the meantime, the rain and snow will be coming to an end tonight. Low temperatures certainly for most of us are going to be in the 30s and then for tomorrow. As I mentioned, northern New York, the first to see some rain showers around here. They are here certainly by afternoon. 35 in Messina, 41 Plattsburgh, 41 in Keysville. We've got some rain showers certainly by later in the afternoon in northern Vermont. So get set for that after the chance for a shower in the morning. Thinking a high Lindenville, just 38. Meanwhile, Burlington at 40. 42 degrees. We'll head on down to the south where again our best chances for rain showers will be in the afternoon. Plymouth at 42, Claremont at 40, and Dover the high is going to be 39. 42 tomorrow, best chances for rain showers I think by the afternoon into the evening commute. 42 degrees on Wednesday as well. Some scattered snow showers first thing in the morning. Thursday looks good. 45 rain showers returning Friday, 55 some morning showers Saturday, and then it looks like we start to clear like Sunday 50 degrees. That's looking good showers on Monday and then the following three days while we'll find some sunshine temperatures. Stewart will be in the 50s.